Uh, so hello everyone. Uh, it's like one or not even one. It's like a uh, half past one in the night, and uh, I'm going today to the Saloniki. If I'm not mistaken, if I pronounce it right, it's in Greece. Uh, so I thought maybe I I should just uh, show you mm, their apartment that I rented. Uh, in Kutaisi, but the thing is that I rented a different apartment, but uh, there was uh, something with that apartment, I don't know what, so uh, the host just uh, like placed me in a bit different apartment, and as far as I know, this apartment is a bit more expensive than the one that I rented. Uh, she said that uh, it costs like around $35 a day, if I'm not mistaken, but uh, like I wasn't charged any money, additional money. Uh, so I will just like do a small tour, I don't know how to call it, so basically uh, this apartment is located on the like second floor. Uh, there is a like stairs that lead to this apartment and it's like covered with some kind of curtains uh, so here is uh, like um, the gas convector so basically heating uh, then you have bathroom it's shower toilet washing machine which is super cool <laughs> because uh, in a few next apartments I won't have it uh, yeah, then uh, the like bedroom, uh, like not much stuff here, but like the bed, which is the most important. And I'll turn up the light. And it's like uh, I'm watching some TV show. And this is like kitchen slash I don't know guest room or whatever. So table, ice stall, washing, uh, I don't sink, yeah, um, a refrigerator, and I still need to pack a few more things. Uh, so uh, to get to the airport, uh, to get to the airport, it's a bit tricky here because, <clears throat> as I read from the internet, uh, there are no buses. Right now they go to the um, airport in Kutaisi, it's, if I'm not mistaken, it's 30 km from the city, but I'm not sure, but it's definitely not in the city. Uh, so to get there, uh, you will probably need to get a taxi. It costs around like 25 lari. Yeah, uh, I, I will also write the um, oh my god, sorry, my brain is just like dying because <laughs> at this time I usually sleep already, so um, I will write um, how much is it in euro and uh, dollar. Uh, so the host of this apartment helped me to uh, find a taxi because she knows some taxis taxi driver, so she just asked him to come here at 2 a.m. <laughs> so I have a, a really fun night ahead of me. I won't sleep at all, I guess, and I'm coming, like, arriving at uh, the Saloniki if there won't be any delays. At uh, 7.30, yeah, and my check-in in my apartment. <clears throat> is at 1 p.m. so I'll try to figure out what to do with the time uh, also I need to get there because <clears throat> the airport in Saloniki is also a bit far away from the city so I need to take two buses to get to the apartment uh, also just wanted to mention that uh, I talked to one of um, the like people who live in the city uh, we were talking about prices for like rent prices so basically he said that 
uh, apartment in Kutaisi. Like I rented uh, this apartment for around 300 euros or something like that. And he said, so basically for this money I can rent the whole house. So I, I know that um, like Airbnb prices are usually higher than the like renting long term. But I don't know. And sometimes it's uh, pretty much uh, like a few times bigger, I guess, than the normal prices. But anyway, I'm not an expert, so I won't tell say anything. So basically, this is it. I'm waiting for my taxi, which is in 23 minutes. Yeah. the Saloniki airport and in fr uh, like next to it or in front of it uh, there is uh, the bus stop uh, where you can take a bus uh, here this is the stop where you need to take a bus number 01x to get to the center of the city and there you can see a small kiosk uh, you can buy this ticket it costs uh, 1 and 80 euros and when you were 80 cents and you need to like validate it inside the bus.